Hi everyone, it's Rabbi David. I hope that you're well. We are fast approaching Passover. And of course, now we've been one year dealing with this pandemic. And as we approach Passover this year, I think there are certain elements of the Passover story and the Passover holiday that really speak in very direct ways to us right now. One of the items on the Seder plate that I think is as relevant as ever is the maror, the bitter herbs. The bitter herbs are one of the few items of Passover that are mentioned actually in the Torah. And the rabbis were very insistent that we all try the bitter herbs at Passover in an attempt to gain just some sense, some understanding of what our Israelite ancestors experienced, the bitterness of their lives, the hardship. And I think we can relate to some of that at least. We know what it's like to endure hardship. We know now what it's like to endure a level of sadness. This has been a hard year, a hard year for all of us, and for a lot of us, a very bitter year. And so as we experience those bitter herbs, we connect in various ways to the various moments of hardship that our people have experienced. But we also come away knowing this, that just as they experience hardship, bitterness, sadness, disappointment, all of the things that we all know all too well now. We also come away from Passover with a newfound sense of hope and optimism. Spring has sprung, the sun is shining, the trees are in full bloom again, and we know that we have so many reasons now to be optimistic, and we do. Like you, I am looking ahead with hope, looking forward to the spring, looking forward to Passover, and God willing, looking forward to better times ahead for all of us. Here's to a sweet, happy, healthy holiday. Take care.